Hello, hello, it is video number two, training number two. I am doing this video training to basically thank you for filling out the survey. Um, you've given me lots of lots of feedback. I've had an overwhelming response from it. And if you haven't filled out the survey, hit, here's the link below, click it, click on it. I would love to get your feedback because I'm launching something that is super, super exciting. It's all about how you can get your machine or your treatment back in the game, earning more revenue for your business so that you can create that dream business that you've always desired. You know, if you could have another five to ten thousand pounds in your business bank account because you've reactivated this machine that's just sitting in the corner collecting dust, why not give it a try? So if you don't know who I am, I am Natasha. I am a salon owner. I've had my clinic now for coming up to nine years. And when I first started, it wasn't easy. It was not easy. You know, I, I was working very long hours. I wasn't paying myself a wage. Now I have completely stepped out of the business. Yes, I'm still responsible for it. Um, yes, staff do still get in contact with me but I'm no longer in the business. So my business runs whether I'm there or I'm not there. So that is what I wanted to create for myself. And now I'm at a position where I can work from home, I can do what I love, and that is helping other people with their businesses. Um, and this training is all about helping you create that dream business for you, whatever that means to you. So yesterday we talked all about your story, and how connecting with clients can help attract our ideal clients. You guys have been absolutely amazing. You've commented on my post and I'm super, super happy. And you're getting engagement from your clients, which is fabulous. That's what we want. So today is all about how you can retain those clients. So the clients that you currently got in your business, you will lose a certain percentage of them. And it's all about how we can help retain more of our customers so that maybe they're trying different services. Maybe they're coming in for one thing and you want to get them to do another thing. If we can get our customers to take on at least three services, they're guaranteed to stick around with you because they're going to be loyal. They, you know, they get more than three treatments done with you and you know, they're, they're coming back to you because they absolutely love you and your business. Day two training is all about how you can retain your current customers. Maybe the current problems you've got in your business that you don't have consistent bookings, that clients are just not rebooking. Maybe they're saying, oh, I'll give you a call when I'm ready. But you want those clients to be rebooking at the end of their appointments so that you are securing that future business. Because we, at the moment, we're currently selling our time for money. And if you've got white space within your diary, then you're losing money. So having those rebookings, having those clients that are booked out for the next six months, 12 months, you know, is priceless when it comes to running your business. So part two of the training is all about client retention and how you can make sure that those clients that you've got booked in currently at the moment are rebooking for a future date because that's going to retain that loyalty and that's what you want within your business. So how are you currently rebooking your clients? I want you to really evaluate how you are rebooking your clients. Do you reach the end of their appointment and say, would you like to rebook? And then that leaves them to say, oh, I'll give you a call or I'll check my diary or I'll book online. You don't want that. What you want to do is create that environment where they might not get an appointment online. You want to create that scarcity to know that they might not, you, you might not be able to give them the time that they want or the day that they want. You want to create that scarcity within your client because that's when you will get that loyal client that will pre-book the next five or six appointments. And that's where you want to get to. Is your current rebooking process working for you? If it's not working for you, then we need to change something. Ask yourself, how could you change the way that you rebook at the moment? What if you made the assumption that everybody that came in for a treatment was going to rebook? How would you rebook that client? You wouldn't ask them, shall we get you booked in for next couple of weeks? How would you, sh how would you show up how would you speak? What would your body language look like? What would your tone of voice be like? Okay, so you're assuming that everybody's gonna rebook. You've already made that assumption. You know that everybody's gonna rebook. How would you rebook that client? You would show up with certainty. You would ask very direct questions. Okay, great, so let's get you booked in. I'm looking at a, a Monday or Tuesday, which day is good for you? or let's get you booked back in for four weeks time, right? I've got a two o'clock or a three o'clock. What would work for you? 
You see that level of certainty in your voice and the way that you're showing up is completely different to, would you like to rebook? Hoping that they might rebook. So really think about the way that your, your body language is, the way that your tone is, and make the assumption that they are already rebooking. And let them tell you, you know, if they don't want to rebook, let them be the ones to tell you. And if you are rebooking, make sure you're taking that booking fee. So I hope this training has been helpful for you. Please do comment on the social media post below. I've got a Facebook post and I would love to get your feedback. How was this training for you? If you show up and make that assumption that everybody's a rebooker, that's it. Everybody in my business rebooks. How does that make you show up differently? How does that affect your body language, your tone? Can you actually make that change within your business and drop your, your results below? I would love to hear about your results. So show up as the best version of you and make sure that you show up for training number three because it is super, super exciting. I can't wait to share it with you. And I'm so glad that you are getting the results that you truly know you deserve.